Well, wearing my Anthony Davis Pelicans hat uh, while I still can. I won't bore you too much with basketball news, but Anthony Davis told the Pelicans today he doesn't intend to re-sign with the team after his contract's up, so this could be the last time he's in New Orleans. I'm going to have to come out and watch a game before the end of the season. But the good news today is that I didn't take any DayQuil. It's the first day that I've kind of, you know, felt a little better. I did just take a three-hour nap, so there's that, but no DayQuil today. I'm improving. Also, good news is that the next legendary raid boss has been announced for Pokemon Go. The announcement went live in-game today. Just open up the game here. Enter a new dimension of raid battles with Palkia. A new arrival to raids will test your strength in 2019. The water and dragon type spatial Pokemon, Palkia, will join raid battles across the world from January 29th at 1 o'clock p.m. Pacific time. So that is about two hours after this video goes live. Uh, until February 28th at 1 p.m. Pacific time. So all through February, Palkia will be the legendary raid boss. Features? Palkia. So no shiny. I mean, it's the first time we're seeing the Pokemon. We're kind of used to that. Legendaries typically aren't shiny when they're first introduced. So let's go over Palkia raid counters. It is a dragon and water type Pokemon. So good typing, uh, the same type as Kingdra, meaning its only weaknesses are dragon and fairy. And right now, we really don't have any great fairy attackers, so the Pokemon that you want to use against Palkia are dragons. So if you want to find your best Palkia counters, here's what you do. Open up your Pokemon, don't type Dagron, type dragon, and there you go. Uh, definitely Rayquaza with Dragon Tail Outrage is number one. Obviously I don't have one powered up, maxed out, but uh, highest DPS among Dragon types, highest DPS among all Pokemon, I think it still holds that crown. Um, <clears throat> other good ones are going to be Dragon Tail, Dragon Claw, that's my legacy, that's a legacy right there. Uh, Dragon Tail, Hur nope, not Hurricane. Double Dragon Moves, Dragonite, there's another double legacy from Ken. Dragon Breath, Dragon Claw, Latios is another good one. Obviously Rayquaza there. If you have Exeggutor with double Dragon Moves, you know, I'm just gonna fast TM the shiny Dragonite. There it is, Dragon Tail, Draco Meteor, double Dragon Moves, Salamence, also a good Pokemon to use. But if we take a look at Pokebattler, Pokebattler will list the best possible counters. In terms of time to win, these are the Pokemon that are going to deal the most damage to a Palkia raid boss. Obviously, Dragon Tail Outrage Rayquaza is number one. Second, Dragon Tail Outrage Dragonite. Third, Dragon Tail Draco Meteor Palkia, if you somehow have one already. Well, once you get your first one, you can use it against the rest of them. Salamence comes in at number four, same moveset, followed by Latios, Dragon Breath, Dragon Claw, and Latias, Dragon Breath, Outrage. And then you see a couple fairy type options. Remember fairy, uh, we only have Dazzling Gleam as a fairy charge move that's really worth using. So if you happen to have a Togekiss with Hidden Power Dragon and Dazzling Gleam, there's an option. That one will actually resist Palkia's moves. Uh, Gardevoir with Confusion and Dazzling Gleam. Again, will resist Palkia's moves. Speaking of which, let's talk about them. Palkia's potential fast moves are Dragon Tail and Dragon Breath. Its potential charge moves, Draco Meteor, Fire Blast, and Hydro Pump. Those Dragon type moves are obviously going to be super effective back against your Dragon types. So uh, just be aware if you are using Dragons and you're going up against a Draco Meteor Palkia, do your best to dodge because it's probably going to do a ton of damage. Hydro Pump will be resisted by your dragons. It's still going to deal a fair amount of damage because of Palkia's stab bonus. And then Fire Blast is going to be the least threatening among the charge moves. As far as numbers, it can potentially be duoed, and I think we'll see that um, from, you know, some of the more hardcore soloists and duoers. Duoists? Is that a thing? Anyway, uh, with like best friends, weather boost, fully maxed out Pokemon, the duo is potentially possible. But realistically, you're looking at three to five high-level players. Uh, if you don't have optimal counters like me, you're probably going to need a group of at least six. And then once you do take it down, the numbers you're looking for then are 2280 for perfect IVs with no weather boost and 2850 for perfect IVs with a weather boost, which would be either in windy or rainy weather, dragon and water type. 
<laughs> so there it is, Palkia coming to raid battles tomorrow, today, as you're watching, about two hours after the video goes live. The first Palkia will start hatching around 2 p.m. Pacific time, because those eggs will start coming up at 1 and then take a little while to hatch. So around 2 p.m. You should start seeing Palkia hatching from legendary eggs. As far as PvP goes, it doesn't make a huge impact right away. Uh, it's kind of held back by its moves. Dragon Breath is a great move, but Draco Meteor, Fire Blast, Hydro Pump, they're all single bar. They're high energy cost charge moves. Um, so it is kind of outclassed by a lot of the existing dragon types in PvP. Now with that out of the way, the rest of this video will be the remainder of my footage from Kansas City that I said I was going to edit when I first had to make my sick announcement video. Well, I finally got it done, went through, um, really enjoyed the trip, so here's a little look at raiding Wafu style with Andres and the rest of the KC Wafu crew, uh, and some very, very exciting special trades. Enjoy. This happens way too often. I know. <laughs> We're about to do some Wafu raiding. Kansas City Wafu. I have one on too, but too cold to show it. Get out of here! No. Well, Andres, you probably know me by now. Uh, I'm the driver. Then there is Jimmy, the NAS the rally assistant. Uh, directions turn by turn. Corey. The number one navigator uh, in the Midwest uh, for Wafu. World. Uh, worldwide. <laughs> worldwide, wow. Okay. Yeah. And then he assisted by Michael. And our runner is John. He will usually see where Michael is at. I've disrupted a little bit, but it won't. System. It won't make a difference between Michael open the door and then he, can still, get he still jump out okay. and run. I see. <laughs> Yeah, so definitely go to Megaphone, stretch. Yeah, nine minutes left on Megaphone. Stretches one? This is a prototype. I got a really nice uh, like space-age polymer board, but I couldn't get a screw to go into it. What I did is I mounted some uh, counter-select magnets to this board. So I've got stability where if I need to get on foot, because I'm, I'm kind of fleet of foot kind of guy. It's like it's a real... That's a timer for our eggs. It's a 30 minute timer, and then when our eggs are up, it reminds us. Because I never remember to You're put an eggs. Yeah, right here. Same. I had to make a shirt. <laughs> I, I keep my iPad ready with all the raids. There it is. So the it left, just guys. keeps everything yeah, perfect. Just pop to the left. Oh, not the shanks? No, the. Luminian? Whatever that is. Um, I think Whoa. he was doing the shanks, <laughs> then Marowak. Where's the shanks? The shanks is somewhere oh, here. I don't know. Look what we found. <laughs> wow. Cool. Yeah. Pokedex Luminion. I guess I didn't need to pineapple it now that it's in the decks, but... Oh my broke free. Yes, let's start with that. Okay. This is Al. Al is from Oklahoma City. He's about to hit 100 million XP. I don't know if that was in focus, but that says 99, 9, 9, almost 100 million. So for the 100 million, we're going to do a trade, a special trade. I'm going to send you something that's very special. Soon. Okay. Perfect. Everyone has that Pokemon that they remember from long ago. Yeah. I caught a wild Dragonite early in the game. It's tiny. Okay. And I actually want you to have that. Wow. It was caught in Portland, Idaho on July 29, 2016. Okay. 
<laughs> this is a very Because you're track. doing a very cool thing for me. So yeah. I, I want you to have this. I appreciate that. Thank you. So here's the trade. An old Dragonite for the Tropius. Special trade for the day. New Pokedex entry. And 100 million XP. Oh, it turned out lucky, and there's the Pokedex. Yes. That is so cool. <laughs> That's amazing. And, and then here it goes. If only there was an animation for this. I know. That's right? it's so undramatic this way. <laughs> I there we just go. my battery just died. Oh no. <laughs> There it is. 100 million XP now. 100 million XP. 100 million XP. Secretly, there's something I would want to give you. Thank you. Inside of this box, I would like you for open it. See that? One of the biggest influencers that's motivated a bunch of people to reach XPs and beyond. Just 20 million XP. Was Brandon Tan to have the hundred mil Brandon Tan badge, who's motivated countless trainers worldwide, and for you to finally reach a hundred mil. Thank you, and you and Brandon Tan, uh, my friends, only one link. Um, Andres, wherever he is. Andres, thank you. Hey, and Nick, of course, thank you. Of course, of course. I'm glad I could uh, like be involved. Oh, you mean it looks like this? It looks like that. <laughs> are, are you gonna wear it? Even I feel awkward doing this. <laughs> I bet you do. <laughs> but it's your creation, and, and you're a good friend, and and I'm glad you could be here. It'll be honored. Yeah. Congratulations, man. Thank you. It's thank a, you. Congratulations. It's a tough accomplishment. That was awesome. Congratulations. Yes. yes. Okay. <laughs> wow. Kansas City is known for its barbecue, and I've been told this is the spot. Joe's Barbecue. It's in a gas station. I also have a video to upload. Thank you. Welcome. We're going back to Cali. We're already That's why I'm wearing my shorts. Oh my god, what are you doing? We're not there yet. Last special trade in Kansas City. Said the best for last. That's right. The Tropius dealer. I don't know how long it's going to survive in this climate, but I'll take good care of it. <laughs> Just keep them warm. Let's go lucky. Oh yes, is it, it lucky? is. It is. Oh, 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 oh. Just dealing those lucky yes, Tropiuses. Yes. Okay. Appraisal. Battle with the best of them. HP, attack, defense. Oh, really strong. That was so. Oh, it was the closest I've gotten so far. Wow. That's great. Nice. Thank you so much. Please don't. Thank you. Appreciate That's it. Awesome. You guys have a safe trip back. Thank you. Yeah. I just want to say one more big thank you to the Kansas City crew for the hospitality. I really enjoyed coming out and spending community day, doing some raids with you guys, and uh, hopefully I'll be back out there and see you soon. Until then, I'll talk to you tomorrow. <laughs>